Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to do a review on a new primer on the market. This is the Urban Decay All Nighter Face Primer Long Wear Foundation Grip. So I think this is coming out, I think it's online right now. I'm not sure, I don't remember. In stores, I thought it said the 26th, but um, it says it preps, smooths, perfects. And, okay, so it's online right now at Ulta.com. It's $36. It just says it's $36. It has one fluid ounce, and it says, like a stage five clinger, all nighters face primer grips your foundation and won't want to let go. Our lightweight formula goes on sheer to perfect your skin, leaving it feeling smooth, hydrated, and slightly lifted. Um, and on the on Ulta, it says the latest addition to the all nighter lineup. This long wear complexion primer goes on sheer, silky soft to the touch, and actually leaves the skin feeling hydrated upon application. It preps and smooths the skin, then grips your makeup in place so that it lasts longer. But it's so lightweight that you can wear it solo. Plus, it reduces fine lines and leaves your skin feeling slightly lifted. So um just into comparison as well i have the milk hydro primer and i'm actually a huge fan of that one i like the milk hydro grip primer um i've tried the cover effects grip primer and i feel like with that one it's way and i feel like with that one it's way too heavy like put it on and it's sticky super sticky but then your foundation sticks in like the one spot it's the stickiest and trying to like blend it around the face it it doesn't move like it's just a spot of foundation so i'm not a fan of that one um my skin is already prepped and hydrated it does feel still kind of dry but i did just put um primer on it says it has a six month wear time too okay and then this is what the bottle looks like. I think the bottle is really, really, really cute. And it has a pump. So today I'm going to be using my favorite foundations and powders and stuff so that I can really test to see how this wears. It is New Year's Eve today and I will be going to a New Year's Eve party. So I'm going to be um, checking in during that too. I don't know how much you need. I just put a little bit goes on. Because I feel like you can put too much with the, it is soft. Um, I feel like you can put too much primer with like the Hydro Drip Primer. And I'm just gonna like massage it into the skin. And we'll see if my foundation looks any different than um, my face feels smooth but it doesn't feel like sticky okay so I'm gonna take my Mac studio fix fluid and NW 13 because I feel like I know how this foundation works because I work with it so much I wonder if you wait too long what happens because I know you have to work quick with like the milk hydro grip one I have a lot of breakouts right now I don't feel like it smooths out texture I feel like it's not <laughs> man I feel like it's not doing anything that it claims I have fine lines on my forehead, so I'm kind of gonna go there right now and see what happens. <laughs> Nothing's wowing me. Just how I've been doing it lately. Um, I feel like my, mm, I don't know. I don't feel like anything. I'll just finish applying it and then talk about afterwards. 
Okay, so I feel like my foundation just sitting on top of my skin. I feel like it did not hydrate my face. My face feels like tight and dry. Maybe that's a lifting thing, but it doesn't like, it doesn't feel good. And I moisturized heavily. I put on like two moisturizers and a serum. So, I mean, let's just finish the rest of the face and see, I guess. Request my chariot, get ya. The doors open. Take that hot road and hop in. Monarch butterflies, you should open up. I'm trying to put your heart together, found it broken up. Going up the smoke, smoking up. Make sure the children in the house, she's inappropriate. The way she's approaching us, I disassociate. Exfoliate, the renegotiate. She's closing up. Come to visit me, she said that she the lonely. Yes. I'm really hating my skin right now, and I don't know. Why? I don't know if it's because I'm having like problematic skin. Like I have blemishes all down my neck and stuff, but God damn. The rest of my face powder, I'm gonna use my MAC Studio Fix foundation powder. And it is in N4, yeah. And this kind of like, I don't know, maybe because I'm breaking out really bad, but, but like I hope you guys can see my skin. It's not really like a huge, oh my God, this is life too. I feel like it didn't grip anything. I really feel like it was like a silicone based primer and just like was trying to smooth everything. That's how I feel. I'm gonna blend more powders on top of it. Like I'll finish my face with you guys and then I'll do my eyes and stuff off camera. My skin. Yep, look at all that texture. Um, it looks like smoothed out on the camera, but I don't know, honestly, my skin feels dry. Like really dry. It does not feel hydrated at all. It feels kind of tight. And I don't really have that issue when I'm doing my makeup, so. I, so far halfway through this, is on the fence about this, am on the fence about this. But I'm gonna do my eyeshadow and eyebrows off camera and probably my hair. And then I'll check back in with you with how my skin looks after that. And then we'll go through the whole day together. Hey guys, so I did finish my eye makeup. This is the Shane Dawson Conspiracy Palette. And then I have House of Lashes Iconic Lights on. And the lip, I'm going to change. I didn't realize how red it was. Sorry, there's still in my eye. I didn't realize how red it was. And it's a new, um, the new MAC lip lacquers. Um, but I love the formula. Um, so this is the face. I'll zoom in. This is the face. So, oh, oh, so far. And I mean, it's okay. Do I think that the primer is life-changing so far? No. Um, my face felt really dry. So, I mean, but after I finish like my whole face and it sits, it's my favorite part of my makeup because it feels like, but I'm gonna get dressed and I'm gonna film some other videos and then I will check in with you guys later tonight. Hey guys, so just a little update. This is my face after, it's 4.30. I did my makeup at 11.30 five hours with this makeup. I've straightened my hair, I've eaten, that's why my lips are gone. But yeah, this is my skin, I'll zoom you guys in. Um, it honestly looks a lot better than when I first put the makeup on. So I don't see anything cracking or being too shiny. It kind of all just settled. It doesn't feel as dry and my face feels kind of lightweight right now. But this is just an update. I still have to go make jalapeno poppers. I'm gonna upload a video right now. And then we aren't going until about like four hours from now, five hours to the party. And then we'll see how it lasts throughout the night. But this is just a little update so you can see my forehead. 
Um, I did, I might have to touch up my forehead because I did lay down for a nap and it looks like there's like no foundation and it's all focused right here. But it's going pretty well. I don't know if I'll, it's like my favorite or if I'll use it again, like so far. I feel like this is what my makeup would look like with a regular foundation primer, but it might be just gimmicky. Okay, so this is my disgusting house. I've given up cleaning because I do it every single day. Um, this is my, it is 7.30 update. Uh, my eyeshadow is falling, but this is what <laughs> I will deal with this in a second, but it's because I'm eating and drinking a rock star because I'm trying to stay up to midnight. This is my skin. And it looks like just worn makeup. You can see my fine lines so, and all of my forehead pimples. But far away it looks nice so i don't know guys it's a freaking primer i think i'm just gonna end this video here because it is new year's and i'm going somewhere to a party tonight and landon's in the background um and i don't think i'm gonna vlog again so honestly it's just a primer i don't think it's worth 36 dollars i'm sure like the elf putty primer or ooh, you guys should get the elf jelly pop primer because i heard that's just like the hydro grip one i haven't used it because i have the hydro grip one from milk but you guys should do that and not waste your money on this sorry Evan, but i just i don't feel anything like wow this is an amazing primer like i did with the milk one my max strobe cream makes me feel great so um yeah i think i'm gonna post this in a few days but it is new year's eve now happy late new year's and i hope you guys are ready for 2020 okay guys so this is it. It's just a primer. I will see you in my next video. Bye!